Hi, I'm Paul Wilkinson and along with Sarah Plater I'm the co-author of Mastering Portrait Photography and in this short video we're going to show how we created this image of Amelie, a little girl three and a half years old, in our studio garden in amongst daffodils. Now firstly I have to make an admission, not dead keen on daffodils, not a big fan, never been a big fan, can't help it and I'm from Wales so I really should like daffodils. However, for purposes of taking a photograph, they're really, really useful. We stayed in our studio garden. We were due to go out to the woods and photograph in the woods with bluebells. Um, the forecast is 100% certain for five millimetres of rain this morning. So we moved everything to the studio so we could still go ahead with the filming and the shooting. And guess what? It didn't rain. This shot, what I'm trying to do with the image is still create that sense of springtime, not involving rain. So what I've done is I've had Emily walk along one of our paths where there's a shape to it and I can see a gap through the daffodils, which just allows me to frame Emily using out of focus flowers. They're clearly daffodils, much as I don't like them uh, nice and yellow in the foreground with some structural colors and pinks and things in the background and Amelie in the middle the tones that so we've picked the color of her coat her mum brought a couple of different outfits and we've tried to choose a color so the tonality of the image all ties together it's all greens and yellows and pinks and uh, those sort of colors daylight lit no reflectors no tricks it's exactly what you see on the video uh, we've got one camera on it um, and, and no lighting one thing you will notice is I've placed Amelie onto the side of the frame on a wide shot those of you who know my work know I like to do this quite a lot but it also looks really good on a wide picture across a sofa or something like that and of course at the end of the day I'm a professional portrait photographer I make her money this way so it's useful to think ahead as to what the product might be lovely simple little shot taken in the springtime 